people of the Purple Butterfly here, otherwise known as people of Southern Twitter and YouTube, people of elsewhere on the internet. My blog is located at Purple Butterfly dash people dot blogspot dot com, and my social can be purchased at people dot etsy dot com. I just came in to show you right quick how the crochet braid looks on top of the existing U-turn braiding pattern I had. This is where it went back into a ponytail. And as you can tell, it makes a very interesting pattern, almost like this crochet braid. And I'm not done with it, it's just how far I've gotten so far. And then when I parted in the middle, where I went through trouble to make sure that all the parts, well, all the attachments were extra small, you can see it gives a whole other different look. But, uh, and if I decide to close in, you know, all those parts will disappear and it'll just look like my hair. Okay. Now, on this side, which I haven't actually got to yet, you can see where the U-turn is going right here. When I do those braids, then I'll get to look like I got on this side where it's doing that effect. So essentially, it's three parts, one style. And then when I'm done, all the hair that's in the little ponytail, comb that out, and it'll blend right on it. So that's how you take... Um, straight connect line and just go ahead and attach it. Um, let me show you this. It looks like this texture, which looks like you brushed out or blow dried your natural hair, except for this is add on hair, so your hair to stay protected or you still have a natural look. Um, I don't trim it because, you know, when it's scraggly, it looks more like your hair when it naturally grew. If I trim it, I'm still going to immediately brush it so that way I pull some of the hair out of that absolute straight blood cut look so that way you don't have that, you know, it'll give a more natural appearance. So that's all I have for you today. Stay blessed, stay tuned. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe.